Headline News Update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here. This is the first trading day of the brand new year, the brand new uh, decade actually. <clears throat> and we've got the market up very sharply and I'm the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour. It comes up straight after this noontime TFN update and I'm also the author of the opening call. Let me just show you this quickly because some of you hear only the uh, updates so maybe you don't know the work that I do. I try to identify the lowest low bar for my subscribers to my opening call. Then we count each successively higher peak. At that fourth highest peak, other things can happen. It can go much higher, but that fourth highest peak is the objective. And it's where you raise your foot off the accelerator and you hover over the break. And we'll see why in a moment. <clears throat> I only look at straight line moves or arch or cup formations. And they can be a combination. So with that said, what do we have here? Oops, that just disappeared. What do we have here? We have the Dow at an all-time high. <clears throat> it made a peak a few days ago. And some of you know that I was talking about the fact that the Qs and the spies hadn't made it. We should wait to see what happens. The Dow could go to an E. And then look at this. The S&P today, the spider and the S&P went to leg D. Made a high of 3250.04, all-time high, stalling a little bit here. It's now up $9 at 3240.02. Um, I'd say $10 pullback. It's in this market, it's not a big deal, but in this particular format right now, it is a big deal because you can see the MACD starting to deteriorate and stochastics now down. Still good, but it's at 86%. We're going to watch this very closely <clears throat> at any point in the next two weeks. SP closes underneath 3200. It's a problem. And if it climbs into the 3263 area, that's really outstanding action. QQQ, same thing. Leg D, pop, gap up with a doji so far candle at 215.16 all time high at 214.61, a little bit off that right now. Leg D in the weekly, leg D in the um, for the SP, only a leg C in the monthly charts are looking out, still very positive, shorter term. I think we're bumping into resistance here. IWM was weaker earlier. Oh, look at this candle. Very big red candle, minus one, 164.65, made a high five days, four days ago, 167.12. So it's quite a bit off that. Three points, uh, two and a half points off, <clears throat> but it is going under the black. Nine, a 14 period moving average for the very first time. If it closes underneath this, that's going to be an issue. And it'll be talking, telling us that something's going on that's different. Gold spiral back uh, over the 1526 high of November the 1st. I'll talk more about it in the next segment coming right.